Welcome to the Thin Within Podcast, the show for women who want mental secrets for weight loss mastery. I'm your host, Marna Thal. I'm the owner of ThinWithin.com, and I'm here to give you the inside scoop on how to lose weight by mastering your inner game. Diets never work for me long term, and if you're like 95% of the rest of the human race, they haven't worked long term for you either. Every week, I'll give you tools, techniques, and resources you need to actually succeed in using the power of your mind to lose weight. I can't wait to teach you another mental secret, so let's dive right in. Well, hello, everybody. It's Marna here, and I want to talk to you today about something very, very different. I want to talk to you about going beyond weight loss to really understand your why. Why do you want to lose weight? But here's what I mean. I want to even go bigger and bolder than that. I want to talk to you about the essence of losing weight and the essence of who you want to be. I think we get bogged down with rules of when we should eat and why we should eat and how much we should eat and is it enough protein and is it enough fat and carbs and macros and all of those things. And it gets real annoying, (laughs) doesn't it? It gets really overwhelming. And then you go, gosh, there's so many rules and there's so many different things. I'm sick of having to follow all these rules. So what if? What if you got connected to the essence of who you want to be that's far beyond, far bigger than any rule, any diet, any way of being with food or with calories? But what if you got connected to what you want to stand for, who you want to be in this world, how you want to show up? And from that vantage point, create the vision, the essence, and reconnect to that every day. Because see, when you know who you want to be, how you want to show up in this world, and you know it's not somebody who overeats, somebody who binges on food, somebody who feels out of control at dinner when you're with your buddies and you eat your face off. You know that you don't want to be somebody who goes unconscious into a bag of chips or a pint of ice cream. We know all of that about you. That is not who you want to be, but do you know who you want to be, how you want to show up, what you want your life to feel like, look like, be like? Do you want to be somebody who has energy and love and compassion with yourself? that can be loving and kind to others and generous and compassionate when you make mistakes or fall off the wagon. You want to be growth-minded. You want to be somebody who lives in ease and joy and the essence of health and vibrancy, who moves their body, who connects to the world in a bigger, deeper, more profound way who recognizes her success. All of those things are the way I want you to see yourself and be and create. And when you then know who you want to be and why you want to be it, and you keep taking a stand for that person, for that essence, all the silly food rules, all those silly Silly things we do with food because they don't align. Overeating doesn't align with the essence of who you want to be. Binging doesn't align. But being somebody who feels good about herself, somebody who says nice things, somebody who wants to make a difference in this world, somebody who's living up to their best, greatest self, when you connect to her on a daily basis, When you connect to who you want to be in this world, then all the ways you want to show up with food start to fall into place. Not from shoulds and have tos and musts and rules, but because it's who you want to be. It's bigger than a silly rule that someone says. Because being healthy makes you look and feel your best so that you can be the most amazing mom 
the most energetic grandma, the most compassionate employee, the loving partner, wife, husband, because that's why. So I encourage you to expand the notion, expand what you want from your health and your wellness. Expand that you just want to lose weight. But why? What is the weight loss going to give you? Who are you going to be? And start connecting to her. Start connecting to that energy, that person, that way of being. And from there, you will reach your goals. See and connect to that vision, that essence, that way of being. And if I can help you along the way, I would love nothing more. And if this is what it takes to inspire you, connect to you, get you in action, then I have done my work. Because when I do this work, I know that when you feel better about your body, when you love yourself more, when you feel confident, you get to leave a better legacy for those around you. You're happier. And when you're happier, your families are happier. Your friends are happier. When you're loving yourself more, those around you can feel that. That's why I do this work. But it's bigger than just the pounds on the scale. It's because I want you to love who you are. I want you to see the reflection in the mirror and fall in love with not just the Little things are the big essence of you, the beautiful essence of your being. That's far, far greater than the scale. So if you want to lose weight, I want you connecting to why. Why does it matter? Who is it that you want to be? And start capturing that essence and living in to that person. All right, everybody, I am sending you so much love. I love you. Take good care of you. Go create your vision and start living into it today.